Carmelo. Here's Carmelo. That's from Midtown. Carmelo Anthony. Yo, what up, 2K fans? It's your boy Venice. We back today with a new video uh, in the Mellow series. We are going to test out Negative Impact Takeover, which is a pretty underrated shot creating takeover. Barely anyone uses it, so we are going to test it out today and see if it can be effective in the context of a park game. First off, rate my drip, bro. Like, rate my drip in the comment. 1 through 10. Drippy Mellow in the building. Uh, when I'm not recording, I get pretty tired of the Mellow outfit, so that's what we are rocking. Nice custom kicks. Little Crenshaw hat with the Bape outfit. Let me know how you guys like my drip in the comment section. And before I forget to, I want to uh, advertise my Twitter. Because when I need guys to run, you guys might want to follow me at venices 2 k I'm going to put it on the screen so that you guys know how to spell it. And uh, yeah, if you want a uh, chance to play with me or uh, maybe help record a video, follow my Twitter, turn on post notices, and uh, maybe you have a chance to run with me. Speaking of post notices, your Venice Gang member of the day is my guy Steve. Thanks for the support, bro. Appreciate you. If you want to be Venice Gang member of the day, make sure you turn those post notices on and comment Venice Gang at the beginning of every video. So now let's not waste any time. And I'm going to show you guys my badges that I run for this uh, negative impact video. So to get uh, even more chances of making contested shots, I put on Gold Data instead of Hall of Fame uh, Circus Trees and Bronze uh, Clutch Shooter. But I'm pretty sure it didn't pop even once, so a, a good waste of a badge here. And the rest of our badges doesn't change, and that's what takeovers we were running in these gameplays. Negative impact reduces the impact the impact of shot contests against uh, basically shot creating moves. So without wasting any more time, let's get into gameplay. All right, game one of four. I think we have four gameplays on this uh, negative impact video. So I'm going to give you guys my opinion on this takeover. Is it a good takeover choice if you're uh, trying to run a similar build that uh, that uh, my mellow build or any shot creating build uh, basically? Is it a good takeover choice? Well, I think not because in this video the proof that it's not a very uh, wise takeover choice is that I actually struggled to even get uh, shots that negative impact would impact so what i mean by that is that this takeover helps on uh, hardly contested shots and i just feel like why would you even want to take contested shots in the first place so that's what i'm that's why i'm wondering if there's really a purpose to choosing this takeover i tried to i tried to make some shots that would show the pot the potential of the uh, negative impact takeover and i actually like struggled to get hardly contested shots like this one is not a bad one it was a yellow contest i greened it with the uh, negative impact take but I, I just feel like i could have greened it only with pull up precision so that's why i'm just wondering if, if there's really a purpose to choose this takeover since your main goal should be to actually shoot open open and good shots so why would you want to boost to uh contested ones so that's what i that's what i'm feeling on this takeover it's definitely not uh the worst take you could pick like there are some worse takeovers but uh i just feel like you're yeah like i was saying your main goal should be to get open and take quality shots so unless you're trying to make like some Kobe uh, fading away on the four people type of uh, montage or edit, I feel like there's no point in choosing this takeover. Even though I made some uh, pretty crazy shots like you saw in the intro, the, uh, the, the shot will come uh, in a later gameplay. So of course, of course it'll make for some nice clips of you just hitting greens on the 60% covered shots. But in a competitive mindset, I don't really think there's a purpose to choosing this takeover. 
So that's my opinion on this takeover. I'm pretty sure nobody else uh, made a video breaking it down because it's a pretty underrated takeover as it should be in my opinion. So we got a nice little gameplay going on here. Uh, I was running with my boy Shower as usual. He's on his 6-9 uh, uh, demigod. Nice green from him. We literally we literally rolled on these guys 18 to 2. That's a that's another nice contested shot for you to see the uh, effectiveness of it. But uh, yeah, as I said, you don't want to be uh, aiming to take these shots. You you really want to get the uh, open shots and high percentage shots, quality shots. So this takeover, I feel like, is much more of a bailout thing if you are if you aren't uh, trusting your abilities to actually get open you might want to run this like as a second takeover a shower gets the pretty nice jelly jelly layup from the 6-9 build as we hit this guy with the turnaround so that's double take i was running uh, pull up precision on my second takeover also so that uh, that helps us even more to uh, green these contested Contested shots. This one doesn't go, but shower gets the board. So I'm I'm getting that limitless step back to fall. Pretty nice shot. Uh, I'm trying to test out the limitless trees takeover also in a further video. Like what if uh, I put on pull up precision first and limitless trees second? I think uh, I think it would make for so it would make for some nice clip like uh, shot reading moves from half court basically so i think that would be nice and uh, shower said you know what i can do shot reading moves too <laughs> as he gets the nice hop shot uh for the limitless range video i'm a way to get the uh, hall of fame limitless uh all hall of fame deep trees i'm currently a 95 overall i need to be a 97 to unlock it on hall of fame so uh once i get it i'm gonna drop you guys this video uh, this is the last gameplay. We are uh, torching these guys up 13-0 now. I got my uh, I got my double take You guys will see me hit a mean standing two-pointer, which is definitely what I meant to do So as we wrap this gameplay up make sure you guys like the video if you enjoyed it uh, Make sure you subscribe if you're new. We're on our way to that big 1k uh, we hit 800 this morning so i want to thank you guys a lot thanks for the support it's been insane and i'm out peace